Hey everybody, welcome back to another edition of Survival Minecraft with JPT. I am JPT. Just hanging up some decorations here, don't mind me. Oh, we need one more. One more. As you can see here, I uh, put these up here. I think it helps it look a little bit better. Uh, it looks a little bit better, at least in my opinion. Didn't realize we needed another one. I forgot this side is a little bit longer. So we'll need to get one or more of those. Had to go hunt for some cows. Uh, cows are in that general direction. They're not easy to find. Also, I went and got a ton of clay. Got a ton of clay. There's a ridiculous amount of clay. Of course, that's just all swamp right there, and that just goes on forever back there. So, uh, read up on some clay and where it is and where to find it, and well, that's where I found it. And we got lots of it. I'll have to show that to you in just a minute. Got a full agenda for today's episode. Of course, wanted to hang those up there first, but uh, did want to actually come in here real quick and uh, do something. Let's see. What was it? What was it? What was it? What was it? Oh, I wanted to show you this. That's right. Um, I replaced all the furniture. What I did was I figured, yeah, this place has been beat up over the years, you know. So you got some some oak, you got some jungle wood, you got some spruce and all that stuff. So basically, all that is uh, all that is different. So that's uh, basically what we're doing today. So, oh yeah. Also, um, whoop, we uh, I, we I dug out the basement here. Um, going to basically do that for you know storage. Um, I think I'll do it for uh, liquor storage and whatnot. That's normal stuff you'd serve at the saloon. So I uh, don't think we'll do that in today's episode, but I did want to sort of give you uh, an idea of what I'm going to do. Uh, let's see, I'm going to extend this down, of course, the foundation, so where it makes sense, and probably dig down a little bit more, and maybe just dig down to see if there's actually anything underneath there. So um, I have fallen through that hole a number of times. So let me go ahead and, oh, of course, I don't have the right wood to patch it with. Um... Let's see, let me grab some more of this. Need some coal, because we gotta start making some brick. Another thing that I've been considering is I hate the way the back of the building looks because it's not even here. Um, I think it just looks kinda funny. And another thing I've been thinking about is maybe putting a front porch on the general store, on the top. And so, that we may or may not get to. But definitely wanted to get to the roof or the back part of the building here today. So let's go ahead and do that. And, of course, I'm going to start building a bank. That is going to happen today. So stay tuned for that. That is going to happen. So the idea is to basically make this match up with that. And we'll have to get some more. But... That should help us out quite a bit. Oh, didn't actually even put it to where I can use it. And I still didn't. Wow, you are just amazing today. And let's see. I want to get rid of this. So that it kind of makes a little bit more sense. Okay, let's go see how that looks from a distance. It just looked funny from when I looked at it. And this is looking way better already. I like that way much. Way much. Yeah, that's a hundred billion percent better with the spruce wood. So we'll keep that. I have to write stuff down now because it's hard for me to uh, keep focused on what we're doing in episodes. Uh, we don't have any spruce except for these four pieces. Hmm... Well, remind me, I got that silk touch from the last time. That's going to help out a lot. Remind me to fix the other side of that. I'll have to do that. You know, that that already just looks better. That just makes sense. It's symmetrical and, and not weird and stuff like that. And so we we'll might be able to make that top room a little bit uh, bigger too. Or maybe not. I don't know, maybe not. Let's at least go look and see what it feels like going up the stairs. We can go ahead and put the other ones on that side too. Yeah, this just seems better in so many different ways. So that would eliminate this. We'll get this to come down. Yeah. And that makes sense. So that way it's a little bit more private back here. But I'm already liking that way better. 
and I think we'll just keep this the way it is. Of course, uh, I think I put one more back here, and this right now is just wool storage, which I think if I'm if I'm thinking right, we might need some more later. But still got that lighting glitch there, which I am not thrilled about. So the roof decorations on the saloon are there. I don't know, does it need more of an overhang or something? I don't know. Like up here, like right where that is. I just don't know. General store we've taken care of. Oh, it needs a back door. That room needs a door. Um, let's just go ahead and... I don't want to use my oak if I don't need to. Um, I just I need to go get some more wood at some point. Uh, yeah, let's just make the door out of the wood here. We should be all right. I just need to put a door on that room. Otherwise, it's just going to feel weird. Um, Let's just make it flush. Yeah, that looks good. Okay. Oh, that's right. need to get that wool. There was a reason why I wanted that wool. Whoop. Uh, actually, let me get it out of the general store. I like keeping clean wool around just in case we need to dye it. But since we got all this orange wool in here... Let's see. Need to make some beds, which again will require some some wood. Oh boy. I was hoping just to straight through record all this, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen unless I can get away without needing so much wool. Or uh, wood, not wool. See, I can't already think. Okay. I give those prisoners their own beds, you know? I was like, I walked in here while I was prepping the episode, and I thought, something looks weird about this place, and it's, well, not only, not not that it, uh, oh, I put that under there, by the way, new gravel, sheriff, it just looked weird, I was like, what is wrong? There's no beds in here. So let's go ahead and get a bed in here, uh, let's just go ahead and knock it down, and... There we go. Much better. And we'll just make them like this. There we go. Cool, cool. Get those iron bars back. Oh yeah, that's already looking way better. Nice. Just double checking all my resources. I don't think I closed the front door, but that's all right. Hmm. Don't think I need any of this stuff for today's build. Another thing I thought about was not only doing sort of storage on top and moving most of my stuff out of here into the general store, which would make more sense. Maybe also digging like a cellar that would have, you know, trap doors here or maybe even here that you could go it down into. Almost like that in there. So I think what we would do is we would keep like our food and stuff in there, like a bar, and keep all of our other stuff in here. I don't know. It's just sort of keeping along with the theme. What do you guys think? Let me know. So I think what I want to do is I want to build our big hotel here. And I think I'm going to wait until the stained clay blocks are introduced to the full version of Minecraft. And I could technically put them in the game right now, but uh, I don't know. I'm real I'm real concerned about that. I get real paranoid. So I know today that we need, let's see here, we need a building that is going to be, I think seven wide is what I had envisioned. So let's see, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is that right? I think that's right. Let's go ahead and get some more of these in here. So that'll be our landing. That's going to make pressure plates. So that's not what I want. Might need to. Take a quick break and go get some other stuff, but we'll try to get by with it now. By the way, if you want to see how much clay I collected, bam, that's a lot of clay. 
That's a lot of clay. And so we will be using that in today's build. So let me go ahead and set this to start making brick. Where'd it go? There it is. Go ahead and toss some more of that in there. And let's see here. Uh, nether quartz is another thing we'll be using today for the first time. I've never really built with it. But we'll most definitely take advantage of it. Let's see. Am I thinking right? I'm going to be working mostly with half slabs. I On the, t on the roof, I think... Let's see, I think I need at least six. And then I need some stairs. That's for show. I uh, need at least six of those. So I'll just take double that. Wow, that just ate that up. That's all right. That's all right. We'll use these very carefully. So. I think I want to use some chiseled nether quartz block, which I've uh, I've seen used. We need. Let's just let me just go ahead and. Yeah, I don't want to put. Hmm. Let's just put a piece of dirt there for now. I'll fix it later. Anyways, I'd like to use a uh, chiseled nether quartz block. Yeah, we took all that, so I get to go to the nether off-camera, of course. I think we actually need more than what I have here, so... Uh, just like anything in the nether, it is expensive. Let's see, is there anything out here right now? Nope. Okay, brick is also something I've never really used too much in at least the PC version of Minecraft. I've used it a little bit when I was playing it on the Xbox. But I love the way the texture looks. Again, another expensive material. This is going to be a very expensive building, I must say. Okay, and I need some more bone meal. So do I have any bones anywhere? Surely I've got bones in here. Speaking of bones, if you've never seen Dread, the Judge Dread remake that they came out with last year, check it out. Not for the faint at heart. It's basically a movie that doesn't doesn't pull any punches. It is pretty in your face about the violence, um, but I like it. I thought it was a pretty good, you know, version of the comic. And of course, the reason why I mentioned Bones is that the guy that played uh, Bones from the remake of Star Trek, the most recent uh, incarnation, he, uh, his name is Carl Urban, he plays Dread, and he plays it very well. And I must say that uh, he is essentially what makes the movie very good. And I rewatched the movie, I guess I don't have, oh wait, I have Bones over here. I rewatched the movie with my friend last night. He had never seen it, and so we watched it together, and he really liked it, and I highly recommend it. Again, a very violent movie, but uh, that's kind of what you're expecting. Basically makes the Stallone version of Judge Dredd look like a Disney movie. Actually, I've seen Disney movies that are just, like, way more intense than uh, the quote-unquote original Judge Dredd, so... Let's see here. Just needed some bone meal to make some more light gray dye. Got a reason for it. Not putting more crates up there. Although I guess I could just go get those. <laughs> Give me them bricks. Give me that brick. Can I put more in there? Did I not grab more than what I put in there? That's silly. We will need a lot of brick. At least, um, again, with a lot of sort of uh, Western buildings, they like to basically make their front look way more expensive than it was. And so we'll be just doing a front brick side. And this, this is the bank is going to be sandwiched between two different buildings, the hotel and, well, the place where gentlemen go to enjoy themselves. For a lovely night of cards 
and whatnot. And then this, we'll be able to make our saloon into a... Eh, I've got ideas for this. I've got an idea or two on how we can convert this over. I think I'm going to make it more open if you get my drift. So we'll be doing that in the future. Let's see. We can craft bricks from right here, which I think is kind of silly. Oh, yeah. We're going to need way more than that. Um, Let's see. That's how you make chiseled quartz block. And I need quite a few of those. I need at least six if that's what my math is telling me. Um, so that's going to be really expensive. Uh, so let's not put those in just yet. Um, let me, since we have seven of these, let's just go ahead and put seven of them, seven of them down right here. I hadn't thought about just using normal clay block for this stuff, but we want to make it fancy. So let's see here. Let's go. I don't know how tall I'm going to make this. Again, this is just an idea in my head. We're, I think I'm going to do double doors here and a double window here. And that really doesn't, like when you're looking in, you're going to be looking in like this, which I guess works. Wow, we are already out of brick. Uh, again, expensive. Not my favorite, but that's all right. Give me that brick. Three. Hmm. So, yeah. Let me go and get some more oak wood. Let me let this furnace do its thing. It's obviously got a ways to go. And I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Man, I really love the way this looks from behind. I just love that. I love the, just the random detail of it. One of my faves so far. This is starting to look pretty good too. Just the difference of color I think is what's helping make it pop. Really? Only 11 while I was gone? Well, I guess this chunk unloaded. Did find a bunch of nether quartz though while we were gone. I had some of that back at the, uh, that place up there. Yeah, no, give me my back. We need it. So yeah, 16. That's going to be really, really helpful. So Let's see here. Let me go ahead and do. Hmm. I definitely need. Yep, that's gonna. Yep, that's gonna give us the six that I feel like I really need. That's enough, and we still have some left over. So, perfect. So let's go ahead and just dig this up because I want it on these sides here and it's got this really cool texture in the uh, John Legacy look at that that's really cool it really makes it pop let's see there and one there so essentially one in each side and in the middle look at that it's already making it look really really nice and let's see that's going to give us three. Jeez. So much. So expensive. And let's see here. Cut down enough for that. Um, let's get to sleep before we die. I just want that to be there. Okay. So we'll let the, uh, the bricks all churn up. Do we have any? Hmm. Nope, we don't have anything here. Okay. I'll go to sleep real quick and keep on working. Sleep in the devil bed tonight. Right. Is there anything in here? I keep checking this like I think there's going to be something in there that I really need. So far, there is not. One thing I wish you could do is like pots, I wish you could put buckets down. That would look really cool. By the way, I just put that on the floor because I figure there's somebody that likes to drink to put his drink on the floor. People are weird. Hmm. Let's see here. Where do I want to do that first or do I want to finish? Let's just finish the front first if we can. We may have to sort of jump back and forth. 
Also, since we have so much sandstone, I think I'm going to use that for the floor. Wow. So I think, you know, so for like when people walk in, there's a pretty decent floor. You know, it's not, you know, the best floor, but it's still, you know, they certainly didn't, you know, stiff anybody on the overall price. And of course, that's also going to make it so that, you know, people can, I think we'll go four deep. People can, you know, just get an idea of how, uh, how nice the bank is, but you know, they had to go and find this, but it's, it's just a decent floor. And let's see. So the outside of the building, I think I'm just going to do an oak. Uh, let's see. Let's keep this. Hmm. Let's make it. So that's one, five. Um, hmm. Seven, eight, nine. And a fun way to blow up cactuses. Bam! <laughs> I think that's as deep as I want to make it. I guess we'll find out if that's good or not. But this is our footprint for the bank. And again, there will be another building essentially that you know will start probably here and might actually come out a little bit further than I wanted to. Probably about right here, I'd say, or thereabouts. So a little bit farther out than the original, but I don't want everything to be like straight across from each other either. So that's gonna help. I didn't, the only thing I really went in and looked at is the brick for the bank. I really didn't look like, look, look like anything else. I didn't really look at anything else. So I'm just kind of assuming that this is all going to look okay. And we're going to have a vault area. And so I think that will be a different, you know, there's no reason for there to be fancy tile in the back area where, our, you know, all the money is. So this will be basically the separation between the lobby and the back area. And then there'll be a wall here. That's a little bit nicer than just putting up stone. So don't worry, we're not going to be putting up stone there. All right, so let's finish the front here. So we've got that. And let's put those there. And... Ooh, that looks really nice. Oh, we should use that on the inside, but I don't want a red floor. And I think I want to do some keystones here like that. Oh, yeah, that looks nice. Luck in the contrast. That's really going to help. Uh, I think maybe iron doors, even though we have to have a button, but maybe that makes sense. Like, hey, to come into the bank, you actually need to be buzzed in. Kind of makes sense. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. So, I got plenty of sand, though. Um, just one window, I think. There's really no reason to make a ton of windows. So, I guess we can get rid of this now. Oops, I don't know why I jumped backwards. That was awkward. Oh, yeah. Looking nice. Although, the... Does need to be a little bit taller. Let's go get some more. There's other things we can use brick for. Let's go get the rest of that stack. I'm already liking the way that looks across from the general store. Wait, that's the furnace. And let's make some more brick. Man, just, just makes you really sad inside when you realize how much brick you're actually not getting. Um, let's build a stairwell so we can get up here. Hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Just like the nether brick. I think just all bricks are supposed to be expensive. It's not supposed to be something that you can get easily. The other reason, again, is why I got the... Um, can I jump and get it? Yep. The other reason why I got the brick... Let's see. 
That might be tall enough. Yeah, I think that's tall enough. I don't think we need to go anymore. Just just a little bit of brick is going to go a long way. Is for the clay blocks. And so we'll uh, we'll get use out of those. That is for show. All right. So this is going to be the interior. Hmm. What do I want to do? Well, I really like the way that's working. And we've still got some of these. I thought I was going to use these for something else, but I kind of changed my mind and didn't tell anybody. So let's get some more half slabs. Let's see. Oh, doing the wrong thing here. That will most certainly do us in. And let's see here. I don't think we're going to need to shoot anything anytime soon. Let's do it like from here. Let's pull up. Pull up. And I thought that was going to be close enough, but it's not. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. How do I want to do this? Maybe we do need more brick. At least one more layer above, I think, is going to do it. I think that's going to help. Although we may not need a ton of them. That might have to just do. I'm just kind of getting tired of... It's like you get 12 bricks and you're like, yeah, I'm going to do a lot. Uh, you know, it's just... It's kind of silly. It's my arch nemesis, Brick. Uh, let's see. Let's put one there. Ah, we'll need one more on the end there. Hmm. Can I replace it? With, let's just replace it with sand for now. And I think... No. I think what I want to do... Oh, yeah. This is going to look nice. And then put these in between. And then let's say, ooh, is that going to reach? Yeah, let's do this safely. Let's not misplace these. Ooh, that might look fancy. Nice. I like that, although these look kind of sickly. <laughs> they look yellow. Not what I was expecting. Not gonna lie. Hmm. Seems like a lighting glitch to me. Because these look fine down here. As my chair just moans. Hmm, that's really weird. I don't know if I like that. If it was white, I'd love it. Not a racial thing, I swear. It just looks gross. Like, like, it, like it's, you know, obviously it's supposed to be that color. I don't know, maybe it needs something behind it? Hmm. <laughs> oh, why is the computer being all... Why does it get about halfway through an episode and it gets all kind of laggy on me? It's kind of weird. I don't know if that's a chunk, chunk loading or not. I want to say it is, but you never know. Oh, come on. Give me that other one. Okay. Hmm. It's been a multi-day project, hasn't it? Although I'm flying right now. I'm just feeling the creative juices. Uh, let's see here. Let's do that. So why is that discolored on the back? It looks fine here. But like here, it just looks so out of whack. And I can't reach it, so I'm not going to bother with it. Maybe, maybe it'll fix itself. I don't know. It's very strange, but I love it. I love this. 
I love the way it's looking. How many times can I say love? <laughs> Need some more oak wood of, as usual. Not going to be a very secure vault, though, now that I think about it. Uh, maybe that's the point. And somebody just blast through the back of this. Hmm, I got spruce. That's not going to do it. Not going to do it. I got tons of iron here, so let's go ahead and make those doors while we're thinking about it. Nope. Need at least that, if not less. And you can't stack them, of course. That's fine. Makes sense, I guess. Almost even. Oh, one more. Duh. Hmm. And I think we'll need to make... What is a button? Can't remember what a button is. What is a button? Hmm. Can't remember what a button is. Maybe it's smooth stone? I don't think I... Yeah, I was like, I know it's something. We'll need at least two of those. Oh, well, if I wasn't full of inventory. Give me my buttons. Daddy needs his buttons. All right. And I think we'll just keep them on this side. Why not? And we'll put a door here. And put a door here. I don't know if that button will... Yep. Nice. Just enough time to run in real quick. <laughs> Give me all your money. Um, Did I really run out of the wood that quick? That's kind of sad. Hmm. Well, I guess we can work on a roof while we're in here. Let's see. What do I want? Do I want to do it like this? No. I want to see some of that brick on the inside. Um, I could have sworn I cut down more trees than that. I certainly planted some more. Let's just run over there. Let's just run over there and see what happens. Is there anything in here? No. I saw the bed. I got really excited, but it's just a bed. Nothing should be spawning in there anyways, because it's all lit up. Oh, wait, it's nighttime. What are we doing? Run! Run! <laughs> Is that something over there? Oh, it's a skeleton. <laughs> That's freaky. Let's get inside. Ah! <laughs> Close the door. Go to sleep. Yeah, I didn't even think about that. <laughs> Just like casually running over there. Oh, there's a zombie. It's probably on our porch. Where did... He's close. Huh. That's funny. Hmm. Weird. So that's another perspective of the bank, I guess. If you want to look at it like that. Where is that noise coming from? Hmm. Somebody's burning up. Hunk a hunk of burning love. See, look, I got all the other kinds of wood in the world, just not oak. Although I guess it really doesn't matter. Yeah, I guess it does if you're on the inside. I was going to say, it doesn't really matter. Hmm. Let's go ahead and not... Let's get a little tree farm going on over here. Why not, you know? Are you not dead yet? Somebody keeps... Someone keeps trying to die. Hmm. Surely it's not in our basement. I mean, they they wouldn't be burning. 
Oh, he is. Why did he spawn down here? Seems pretty well led to me. Hmm. Maybe not. Hopefully that does it. It didn't sound like it was him burning up, though. He was inside. So, yeah, that didn't make any sense unless he spawned up there. You know, not him, but somebody else. Okay. Let's, um... Oh, there's a creeper right up there, too. What the heck? Um... I don't even know how long this episode is. It might be way longer than usual. Nice. And we'll go in for the final blow. Come on, bro. Gotcha. Give me that experience. Alright, where do we want to plant these trees? It's going to be temporary, so let's just put them here. Let's just put them here. Um, we'll just do... This tree should go pretty fast. Oh, that's not far enough apart. Let's do that. That might be overkill, but that's fine. That is fine. So I'm going to check on these trees, let them grow real quick, get this all situated, figured out, and be right back. All right, I'm back, cutting down some more trees. I'm just going to keep these trees over here because, honestly, there's things happening over here, and I don't want to miss out on them. Um, let's just make more of these into bone meal. More of these into oak slabs. Let's see here. Ooh. Get rid of this cacti. Cactus. Just one. And so, uh, took care of the roof. The back part of it, I'm still not 100% sure about. I mean, it looks kind of dopey. But I uh, thought maybe we would get something else going on later on. But uh, just, you know, look at the front here. Um, it, I think it works. I think it works. Uh, these really set it off, I believe. And then, of course, when you walk in, this is glitching out. Need something for a light here. But, uh, yeah, I think we'll need to get some walls going on up here. And I have the perfect things for that since talking about lighting glitches or just glitches we have a lighting glitch that we can remove let's get rid of these I've got an idea for these to make them look more vaulty look how much darker they look when they you know after they pop up that's so strange and eh, we got eight there we can make some more uh, let's put these in here let's make some more room uh, anything else that needs to go in there? Didn't look like it. Not at the moment. I can jump down, no problem. Yeah, I love our little bank here. Let's see, let's put these in. Again, longer episode than usual, but hey, not every episode. Oh! Why did I think I was going to have enough? Oh, because I counted six over here. And we need 12 total. So, super glad we've got that uh, wool up on top. But yeah, not every episode do we build an entire building. I mean, I just, I had a vision, and it was beautiful. Let's do five. Oh, I can do all my crafting from here. No, I can't, because I don't have the die, which is all down here. I knew I was keeping it over here for a reason. Man. How many, this is our fourth day? Seems like it. It's crazy. So let's see here. I encountered a lot of uh, octopi, I guess is what you would call it. Let's just do this. 
I don't know why I needed nine, but whatever, I'll take it. What what am I doing? Yeah, well that just stays there for now. <laughs> I'm like losing it. Okay. Duh, Jason. Uh wool. Where's the wool? Okay. Throw that down. Let's see, let's just get rid of some stuff. We got way too much stuff in our inventory. I'm just waiting for Waiting to blow up here, so let's get rid of all non-essential stuff. Just in case we blow up. We need this. Wow, that filled up fast. Oh my gosh. Please don't let anything spawn in here. That would be bad. That would be bad. Let's go ahead and light this up. There we go. We are locked in here, though. That is for sure. Ironclad. Ah, uh, we need one from up here. <laughs> well, ugh, that's the one thing I hate about these doors. Okay, that glitched. There we go. Nope. Yep. Anybody around us? Ooh. Nope. By the way, bought my wife this uh, real cheap... John Wayne collection. It's like four discs with like every John Wayne movie on there. What am I looking for here? I'm looking for wool. Looking for wool. Um, did I use it all? Yes, I did. Anyways, I um, bought her this and she, um, as, as of this episode, has not found it yet. I kind of just nonchalantly left it in uh, on the entertainment center. See if she finds it. It was one of those $5 deals at Walmart, which I can't stand going to Walmart as it is. Um, but basically... Oh, what? Did, uh, 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 whatever. I did not see that before. Anyways, it was one of those $5 deals in those bins. And uh, my friend, I actually learned something about my friend. He actually enjoys going through all the cheap DVDs. Although I'm basically converting everything over to Blu-ray, so I rarely will buy a DVD these days. Unless it's for something that you know, I'm just like, you know what? You know, I'm never going to buy this on Blu-ray or I'm never going to find this on Blu-ray. And essentially, she loves John Wayne and she doesn't actually care if, you know, the quality of the... Uh, other things as much as say I would so I bought it for her and we'll see what she uh, what she thinks she's a big John Wayne fan though way more than I ever am that's uh, that's pretty cool so you know I think that's gonna do it I think uh, we'll open up the next episode and sort of get some ideas to decorate this I've got an idea for the vault already I've always had that but uh, yeah so you can kind of get an idea you know the other buildings are gonna butt up against this one and we'll uh, we'll go from there so again uh, if as always, I keep saying the word again, but as always, if you like what you saw in this episode, I know it was kind of like rapid fire, uh, not on caffeine, surprisingly enough, but I felt like I was talking really fast and doing a lot of stuff. But if you like what you saw, leave a like, that uh, helps me out, and also, uh, by all means, subscribe if you haven't done so already. Subscribing numbers are going up, and that is helping me out in more ways than one, and of course... Leave those comments. That's always helpful, whether they uh, are just a quick little like, hey, I enjoyed this, or if there's something specifically you want to point out or make suggestions to, I would appreciate it. So until next time, this is JPT. Bam. And I'll be seeing you.